22 years, that's how long free youth art programs have been running in Providence. And it's all a part of New Urban Arts. And here now this morning to tell us all about their upcoming birthday bash, 22 years, I love this, it's Executive Director Daniel Schleifer. Good morning, sir. Hey, Brendan, how's it going? Great, welcome to the show. Thank you. Uh, Thank let's you. remind folks out there, if they are unfamiliar, what New Urban Arts really is all about. Sure, so let's say you're in high school, you go to a school that maybe doesn't have the resources or the facilities to provide all the cool kinds of creative learning opportunities that you really need as a young person. So you find out about New Urban Arts, you make your way over to our studio on Westminster Street in Providence, and we have everything. We got photography, screen printing, a recording studio, area for fashion and sewing, computer lab, everything and a lot of really cool grown-up professional artists who know how to use all those resources. So you have a chance to learn all those things that you can't learn in school. Uh, and uh, it all happens after school. Fantastic. Three to seven. Yeah. I have always been a tireless advocate for the arts. I believe it's so important that young people are exposed to them and have the opportunity, whether they become interested in, for the long term or not, but just the fact that they can be exposed to these things and maybe develop an interest, it really is crucial, isn't it, to their overall development? Yeah, that's right. And for uh, young people who even aren't planning to go into the arts as a profession, there are so many benefits. There's certain things we can learn through the arts, empathy and compassion, as well as, you know, cognitive skills like collaboration and uh, critical thinking. Uh, all of that, all that comes with the arts, and uh, that's, you know, what our young people need, and that's what our young people are learning at New Urban Arts. It must be just endlessly gratifying for you, you know, two decades plus, knowing the impact that you're having, seeing these uh, young people go on to further their careers, and knowing that perhaps that creative spark was ignited by you guys. That's right, that's right. We've had over uh, 4,000 students now come through our doors in, uh, in 22 years. So it's outstanding. It's pretty exciting. So it's time to celebrate. What yes. do we need to know? Yeah. Absolutely. So April 12th is our 22nd annual birthday bash, um, and uh, tickets are 35 bucks. It is the most, I'm, I'm a little bit biased, but I'm going to say it's the most fun fundraiser uh, in town. It's not, it's not, you know, a black tie event. It's fun. The music is great. The food is incredible. I got to give a shout out to uh, our co-presenters, uh, Bottles Fine Wine and the East End Restaurant. They always hook it up as well as El Rancho Grande, who are actually there cooking live that night. Uh, it's a super fun event. Again, uh, April 12th, so a week and a half away on a Friday night. Uh, 7 to 10 p.m. Well, certainly a tremendously laudable pursuit, and you are to be commended and congratulated on two decades plus. Best of luck with the event. Cool, thank you. Great stuff, Daniel. Good Pleasure to, to have you here. If you guys would like even more information on New Urban Arts, just a terrific program, we have it all. It's posted right now at roadshow.com.